Right, so we're making a quick, simple dish today. A couple of onions chopped up, a couple of oxo cubes, salt and pepper. And then here, let's get this out. I've got some rabbit, liver, kidney, heart, a bike strap chopped up into nice chunks. What we do, just let this pan get a little bit warmer. Get onions in. Just get them cooking down a little bit. Get them in there. Use this. A bit of extra heat on that. Once the onions start to sweat down a little bit. I'll add my meat. So that's my rabbit. Like I said before, livers, heart and kidney at the bottom of that. And rabbit bag strap. Chops in nice chunky pieces. Couple of oxo cubes. Salt and pepper. Got my onions frying off. My kettle boiling so I can make a little bit of stock with them. Pistol cubes. Right, the same onions. Brown it up nice now. It's time for meat. Just drain that blood off. Now you can see heart, liver and kidneys in there. So I start cooking away nicely. Like I say, I'll only take a couple of minutes. Looking good. See a little kidney there, a little heart, kidney. There's liver in there as well. That's a nice piece of liver. I've done just a bit of filler, a couple of, well, about one and a half carrots there, just to chuck in. Ideally, it should have been mushrooms, but we've used them, so carrots it is. Turn that down now. Oxos into boiling water. I'm just going to put two in there because I don't, I don't want it thick on it, quite a thin sauce. Get that in. 
Well, let's get on a stair. Let that start dissolving. Perfect. What I'll do now, I'll transfer this into the pan. All that goodness into there. for this oxo mix all I want to do without spilling it everywhere Just scrape that around the pan absorb all them juices into there it up, get everything nice and submerged, get the carrots in, drop them in gently, so it'll splash all over, quick wipe our hands, and get some heat back on. to do, just want that to simmer, so I need, a, need this, just mix it around, just like so, get it all mixed together, and we simply let that simmer now for a couple of hours, let me pump, So there we go, nice gentle simmer, I've just added a splash of Anderson's relish into the Yorkshire's finest, no stews complete without Anderson's relish, a couple of hours time, that'll be absolutely delicious. That looks like it's ready to serve up.